Cloud printing is one of the major enhancements in KitKat, the latest Android release from Google. In this video, I'll explain the procedure to perform cloud printing. Using this feature, we can print a document, an image or a web page to a cloud printer or to a local printer which is configured for cloud printing from anywhere, anytime. You can check out google.com slash cloudprint to get the list of printers supporting cloud printing from various manufacturers. Now let's see the procedure to configure a local printer for cloud printing using Google Chrome. First of all, we have to launch Chrome and we have to sign in with the same Google ID and password of your smartphone or tablet. Then you click on customize and control button in the upper right corner of the browser window and select settings and then scroll down and click on show advanced settings. Then you can further scroll all the way down until you see Google cloud print option appearing and click on manage button. Now click on add printers to add the desired printer to be used for cloud printing. You can see the list of all the system printers you have in your operating system. By default, all the system printers will be taken for cloud printing. You can just uncheck or disable unwanted printers and click on add printers button once again to include your local printers for cloud printing. These printers will appear in your smartphone or in your tablet. And when you give a cloud print, you should see to it that the computer which is connected to the printer should be on with the Google Chrome signed in with the same Google ID. Now I'll go to settings option in Nexus 7. There, there is an option called printing. I'll select that option. There I can see that the cloud print is on. When I click on cloud print, I'll see the same list of printers which were configured in the Google Chrome of the computer which is connected with the printers. Now I'll go to gallery and I'll select a photograph which is captured using the camera. Just select the menu in the upper right corner there you will see the print option. Just select that and you will see the printers which are configured in the Google Chrome. You can also control the various parameters related with printing such as number of copies, paper size, orientation, etc. I'll select the printer and I'll tap on the print. Now the printout is sent to the Google Cloud. Now I'll go to www.google.com slash cloudprint in the Chrome and I want to see my cloud. I'll just click on printers to see the printers once again which are configured before. Then I'll click on the print jobs. Now you can see that presently there is no print jobs. You have to wait for a few seconds for the print jobs to appear here. Yes, now it has reached the cloud. You can just uh, check out the status of this print job and the status is displayed as queued. At this stage, if you want, you can uh, delete the print job uh, or you can get the details such as uh, the status of it, uh, the time, date and day when it is sent and the printer description, etc. You can also press the refresh button to refresh the print jobs. Now the status is updated as in progress. Within a few seconds, your configured printer will give you the printout. Here it is. It is printing the print job. So this is how the cloud printing works in Android devices. So using this technique, now you can print from anywhere, anytime using your Android device. So that's all about cloud printing. Please don't forget to give me a thumbs up by hitting the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to my channel and get back to me with your valuable comments. Thanks for your time.